Okay. Whoa! I can make you put your phone down. Right here, how many people here went out on that for Valentine's? You know about where it's at? Hey, it's your Valentine night. We're gonna just reincorporate Valentine's Day tonight. You know what I'm saying? You might find your Valentine. We just an open environment. You know what I'm saying? Everybody just meet the person next to you. You know, you never know. That might be your boo next to you on Valentine. You know what I'm saying? Just embrace. <laughs> just embrace having a good time. Hey, that might be your boo next year. Ain't nobody that chill, baby, gonna be somebody in a minute. Even if you just come over to bring you your tacos, it's gonna be somebody over there in a minute. Just enjoy yourself and enjoy your night, you know what I'm saying? I ain't had no boo for Valentine's either. I had two, 13 kids I took to dinner. They said, we love you. I love you, Miss Lee. I said, I love y'all too. Where y'all dad at? Yeah, y'all dad married or something? See, there's something over here to me. I don't discriminate. Hey, hey, you know, Valentine's don't matter. And I'm going to tell y'all a good thing. I'm going to teach each and every one of you guys how to save money. Okay, all you gentlemen out here. If you didn't get them a Valentine's Day on Valentine's Day, all that shit, 75% off the day. Go over there and put a note on the door. We tried to deliver, but the delivery was unsuccessful. And take that shit back tomorrow. <laughs> She's like, yeah, I got something for Valentine's Day. She gonna post it too. She gonna post it. I got a Valentine's Day probably about five days later. But still, I got something. He still love me. So, thank you guys. And, uh, Enjoy your food. I'll be back in a minute. We got some funny comedians. We got some funny people who are going to make you laugh. Even if they ain't funny, look at their ass like, yeah, you could be funny. You come back to home one more time. Okay? Give us a couple minutes. Enjoy the music. Y'all want to dance? That's fine. Y'all want to twerk? I don't care. I don't think we got no twerkers in here. Because we call the ambulance on y'all old ass. Don't twerk too hard. You know what I'm saying? But we are open environment. Be you, do you. Don't slip your nose up at the next person next to you. Cause that might be your boo next year on Valentine's Day. <laughs> All right now, enjoy. Oh, And they were talking about big balls and all that stuff. I won't give big balls a funeral. I don't want no man who balls are big. If your balls are bigger than your penis, don't call me, don't text me, don't remember my name, don't do shit. If you Big balls in your drawers. Damn, put your phone down. Don't call me. Don't text me. Don't remember my name. Nigga, I act like I'm a slave. Like, bitch, please. Because the big balls are out of style. Y'all know how to clap that. He's been here since 7 o'clock. He's been doing an awesome job. And I just want to thank him for just coming out to give me some kind of support. My name is Foxy Gunn. On Facebook is Shalia Gunn. I am a divorced bitch, happily divorced. My ex husband would call me another week time. I didn't mind woman call you. I said, bitch, what woman? My girlfriend. She wants, she saw that I pay for your cell phone, car insurance, and your mortgage. I said, tell that bitch you're a cheater and this is the damn. Either you pay this shit or you go to your electric chair or I kill your motherfucking ass to decide what you want to do. <laughs> I said, but I haven't received a call from that switch back. Y'all know what? All comedians are bipolar. Some fuck wrong with us. 
bitch, I'm bipolar. So I switched out to say, well, I, unfortunately, she has not called me yet, but if she calls me, I will let her know that she's fucking a cheater. And he's like, don't tell her that about me. Nigga, you know you're a cheater. I caught you cheating on me five times. You're a crooked T motherfucking ass. And I see you keep your ass on my insurance. Your broke down little dick ass. I, I said, we were mad for 12 years. I cheated on your ass for 13. I said, you know what? Well, and you tell that bitch you don't even eat no pussy. Don't tell her all that because she will be very upset. I said, you know what? Emancipation Proclamation. That was the day I was born. June 19th, when the slaves were freed. This pussy is free right now. So all that shit you talking is talking to some free pussy. All y'all who don't like talking dirty, I apologize because I love talking dirty. And I want to talk about Valentine's Day. Anybody get a Valentine's Day present? No. I ain't get shit. No. But I'm gonna go and fuck that nigga and let him eat this pussy while I leave over here. I said, this is the Valentine present, nigga. This what you gon' get. I'm gonna choke that nigga tonight in a few minutes. He right over here on Merrill Road. He's a police officer. If I were trying to do a video, I would tell that motherfucker nigga name. Yeah, cause you know, he is the truth. Anybody want some good dick, follow me over on the road. I'm gonna go first, bitches. I'm going first. You go second, you go third, you go fourth. Cause that nigga killing puss on the road. And you know what, that show that I'm not a selfish lady. Cause I will share the dick with all of my constituents. I am willing to share the dick with all my constituents over on Mayor Road. Cause baby, if you had a dry spot, he gonna knock that shit out. Cause it's over on Mayor Road. He is good. He is good. Lady like church, God is good. God is good. But the nigga is good. He is good. And I told him, I told him. You know what? That dick was so good, I made an appointment at 9.30 this morning. I said, when I finish my coming night, if you don't mind, I'd like to come by your house and we can engage in some sexual activities. If you don't mind, I'd like for you to put your knees on the carpet and let me scrub it for you. He said, well, I'll let you know. Nigga, please, I'm not calling. The car outside go hit 110, hit it to Mirror Road. If anybody, you dried out, you ain't had any good dick in 2017, let's have a parade over to Mirror Road. Cause he will engage in some nasty activities. I never had my pussy ate, so I went to Mirror Road. And Mirror Road is exactly two miles from where we are right now. And he is good, God is good, all the time. All the time, God is good, all the time. And uh, I'm going to do the church, the church newsletter. If you go to Agab Bistro on Thursday night, and you ain't get fun for Valentine's Day. Follow comedian Foxy Gun to Mirror Road and you get that pussy beat up. Cause God is good all the time and all the time. God is good. I know he missing on you too. Never tell anybody. He a lying cheap motherfucker. Tell my son, he ain't got nobody but me. I went in there and I saw bitch drawers on the ground. I said, well, why do you drawers on the ground, babe? You know, I washed clothes two years ago. I forgot to send them back to my wife. I said, okay, babe. It's okay. You 56. Put that goddamn oxygen mask on your face and beat the pussy all up. Cause God is good all the time. All the time. God is good. Y'all know a nigga did good when you talk to him, your pussy get wet. Anybody out there pussy got wet from a conversation? I called him and said, Hello. I had 
chain in my drawers. <laughs> Hello! I said, that's okay. A God is good, and all the time, and all the time, a God is good. And this is going out for the gun wedding. Let the women, let the men go to the strip club, cause the pussy's high in the strip club. And they can't pay for the wedding if they buy the pussy in the strip club. Cause God is good all the time, and all the time, God is good. I want to thank each and every one of you guys for coming out. My friend Michelle, I love you. Cause you understand, cause you know this bitch right here crazy. I'm bipolar. That was my ex husband told me. When I said, bitch, say my goddamn alimony. He said, bitch, you bipolar. I said, God is good. And all the time, and all the time, God is good. Thank you guys for coming. I want to make you put your phone down. Yeah. I can make you cut your phone off. Put your shit on vibrate. Yeah. I can make you cut your phone off. Got you in the zone now. Do things my 